Hey guys, on today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to export SVG for your website. Doesn't matter if you guys are using Mew, Streamweaver, or straight up code, this is the appropriate way to do it. So, first of all, just make sure your vector file is an AI file. As you guys can see, my text is right here and I can change it to whatever I want. Plus, this is a standard vector file. All right, so let's just get down to it. Going to File up here and then Save As. Under Save As, you guys will choose down here below. SVG. So just choose this option, okay? Then we're gonna use artboards. We just have one artboard, so I can select all. From here on the side, I can see save. Now this is the most important part about your SVG to avoid any problems on your websites. Again, doesn't really matter where you guys are at. Dreamweaver or straight up code, Muse, this is the way to do it. Just make sure you guys have this selected. Okay, it's not a huge deal if you guys choose anything else. Uh, for SVG, this is the most important part. You guys want to convert to outline. And under links, you guys want to embed. Make sure these two are converted to outline and embedded. That way you guys avoid any problems later on once you guys are importing the SVG into your website. All right, then just choose OK and you're good to go. So before I do that, I want to show you why we converted this to outline. So see this text right here? So I can edit this text and your website, once you guys convert it to an SVG, will try to read that text and you might have problems with the fonts themselves. So what we're doing is converting this into outlines. So technically we could go to type and just create outlines for that text. So it's no longer actual text, it's just an image, right? So we could do that and then save our SVG and we would be okay. But a lot of you might have problems with that because later on you might want to edit some text. So that's why we save that AI file first and then we just save your SVG, like I said, right down here, SVG, use artboards, save. And from here, just choose outline. That way it's gonna outline it for us and we don't have to worry about that. Embedding, we're embedding just in case you guys have any images in there, they should be embedded. So again, to avoid any problems with links or anything like that. Other than that, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you can write them down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.